You think people are ready to hear about me? You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time. Wow, Carly's smart, guys. I'm not sure if you noticed, but Carly's fucking smart. She knows what she's talking about. She may be as smart as Clementine. Who knows? Yep. Do you feel safe here? feel safe here. Show me a bath with a heated floor in oh, the high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know. This place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. That is true. Very practical thinking, Lily. Unlike some people. Excuse me. Yeah. Let's go ahead and look into this thing. Of how bad Lily is at her job. But first, we should tell everybody that I'm a cold-blooded murderer. Yo, Clementine, I'm a murderer. Quinn, I need to talk to you for a second. I love murdering people. Before I met you, before the plague, I killed somebody. Oh, mm -hmm. so that's what... Yeah, that's it. It was mm -hmm. a bad thing and there's no explaining why are you telling me? Because I didn't want to keep it to myself anymore. Yeah. Do you have any questions? Oh. You can go on back to your things. Oh, such a good, such a good goyle. And so she understands what I did. Oh, such a good goyle. Such a good goyle. Oh. Always supporting me. All right, let's go ahead and talk to Katja. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. Oh, we all spat. Guns now, and I don't like it. It's I don't want to. <laughs> He's kind of right. I'm not getting used to it. He's kind of right. You should probably carry a gun, Katja. It's pretty important. Uh, Katja, can I talk to you first? Or about the guns real quick. About the guns. Don't you start. <laughs> I'm on your side, Kenny. Calm down. I just wanted to say, Kat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. It is probably good. But, but we need them. We need them. No doubt about see, that. see, Lee is good at delegating, being bipartisan there. He's like, it's good that they make you uncomfortable, but you still got to fucking carry them. Now fucking carry them, okay? Talk to you about something. Sure. Is everything okay? <sighs> I'm just a fucking murderer. I love murder so much, Katja. That's all I can think about is murder. I've killed before. I mean, before the walker showed up. Yeah. I mean, you were a murderer. Yep. Same and I loved it. <laughs> it was in a dispute. Yep. Would he have killed you? Probably not. I don't know. Probably not. Being honest here. What happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy? Oh. Oh, <laughs> okay. I trust you, Katya. I held him you... back. And Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. Yeah. What did he do? Oh, smashed his face in with a rock. Oh, a salt lick, which is essentially a rock. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's no fun. No fun. Katya. Gotcha. <sighs> no. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. No. Not very good. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Uh, All right. So, um,. Here's one of the things. Oh, she's looking at you, smiling, liking what she sees. Oh, no. What the she? No, I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before. I'm kind of staying silent for this part because it's. I know. I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and, you know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yeah, I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Shit. 
Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. See, that's a good friend right there. And he only behaves like this if you agree with everything that he says. Uh, or do all of the important shit. So if you draw the line at murdering an innocent man, guess what? Do you know what he says? You know what he says when you say, oh, I used to, I killed somebody before all this happened? He's like, well, you know. Well, you know. You fucking, if we're gonna, we're gonna, if, you know, we're going on this fucking boat and numbers start, start becoming an issue, this is gonna be a problem. And it's like, fucking, God, God damn it, Kenny. And like, you can literally be nice to him for everything else except for that one part and he's a total fucking dick about it. Straight we can get it given all that's happened. Yeah, and that's So what then? That's, that's true. And that's, what and that's true. In this kind of a situation, he's making sense right now, which is why I think some people are tricked by him, tricked into thinking he's a good person. But he's not. He's a horrible person. More or less. But I wanted to give you guys this side of him because most of the Let's Plays that I've seen do not show this side of him. And I think it's important to appreciate the many sides of Kenny, which is why I'm agreeing with everything he fucking says in this Let's Play. Let's go. Ah, delicious. I like to tell everybody that I'm a cold-blooded killer so that they know what's up. Ben, I need to tell you something. Yep. Surely, is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. <laughs> He's such a, such a fucking... I want uh, to do a good job. I want to do a good job. I'm a convicted murderer. Yeah. Whoa, seriously? Yep. Why would I joke about that? I don't know. Um, wow. You're a part of this group and you should know. I've never met a murderer before. <laughs> well, I mean, I know, eh, I know what you meant, you fucking idiot. <laughs> for trusting me, man. I, Aw, uh, he's grateful. Relax. Okay. <laughs> he's he has no idea how to deal with the situation. Ben won't forget that. <laughs> is there anything weird? Anything weird on watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Okay, cool. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Yeah, it is good, especially if you're on watch, Ben. We don't want things going to shit when, you know, you're not on watch. Or, wait, shut up. You ever come down here to make it much? My brain, much reason to. my brain you're can't focus because my brain is just filled with, what's in Macon? with tired. Kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. Oh. Uh, I grew up in Macon. Oop. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. I just meant to say it was a piece of shit. Nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. That's <laughs> so good. What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. Yeah, she should. Yeah. I'm just worried. Scares the crap out of me too. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. What a piece of shit. All right, is Duck around? Can I talk to Duck before I start this next part of the quest? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think it's possible. All right, let's uh, let's walk this way. Uh, and now we gotta go tell fucking Lily this. Open the door. We also have to deal with the fact that you gotta be like. Excuse me. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Yeah. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Uh, it's following up about you're coming unhinged. You have to fucking chill out. I'm following up about the stolen stolen supplies. About stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? No, <laughs> I'm not stealing Have the supplies. You here to confess? No. I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Okay. Somebody, one of us out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Okay. For real? Who? What do you have to go on? You're just really, you haven't really been seen. For real? Who? What do you got? Yeah. Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. That's not... That's not... It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy... 
fuck anything with opium in it. Okay. See the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. Oh. That one's getting messed with. I'm gotcha. I'm mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So yeah. You want me to start one? Yeah. I want you to poke around. With my with my dick. That's all I know how to poke with, Lily. Say to go off. This, this broken fucking flashlight is proof that people are stealing shit. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Uh, oh, I don't want to make her mad, so she'll kill me. So I'll poke I'll poke around a bit. Thank you. If you don't find anything, I'm just going to assume it's you. Ah, uh, that's not good to do, man. A mystery. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> this is a great part. You need to unhear all of that. <laughs> so so fed up what with this. <laughs> You're the grease detective. So and good. I should be Dick Grayson, your ward. <laughs> That's Robin. I know who it is. Yeah, I'm a professor. I know everything. All right, you can help. Don't tell anyone. No, if you tell anybody, there will be trouble. Fine. You're Robin. <laughs> what do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. And, uh, let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. This is this is Lee being a good guardian of children, figuring out a way to incorporate them in your activities so that you're spending time with them and they're having a good time. We also still have to tell Lily that we're a fucking murderer hey. because I like to tell everybody that Fine. I just love murder. Uh, so Lily, you know when I murdered your dad? Well, turns out that's a bit of a trend. What is it? <laughs> uh, I'm someone before all of this. You think that's news? I guess I hoped it was. Worse, did you think that story died with my dad? No, I've told everybody. Anything else? No. Lily won't forget that. Yeah, that's okay. Alrighty. Uh, I forget if Carly has anything to say after all of this. So let's go check on Carly, because I like talking to Carly. Because uh, she kind of has a thing for us, and I liked, you know. Alright. Uh, do you know anything about this flashlight? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know yeah. It's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. <laughs> it uses just one. <laughs> Everything should. Okay. Uh, call back. And he was cool. He just worries about his family. Yeah. Wasn't so hard, was it, tough guy? Talk to Katja. Talk to Katja. How'd she take it? She was fine, I guess. I think she's more upset about Kenny. Yeah. So the St. John's? What exactly did he do back there? Yeah. You start now. Yeah. I talked to Clementine about things. How'd she handle it? I don't know. She's tough to read. She is tough to read. Don't worry. Oh, thank you. I uh, told Ben. You told Ben? Yep. Funny you picked him. Low risk. Yeah, no, if he, he tried. I take it he didn't know what to do with the information. Not even a little. Yep. He's just happy I told him something. Yeah. <laughs> it's silly. <laughs> And Larry spoke, obviously. It went about as well as you would expect. Yeah. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Oh. Hey, Clementine. Hey. You didn't have a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? Oh, Did no. Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Oh. What? Putting a bug on his pillow? Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's so good. Good. Oh god, I This game is so good. This game is so fucking good. Do you guys know anything about this, this flash flashlight? Did you fucking break the flashlight? Did you break the fucking flashlight? The 
glass. You better tell me before I break it over your head. Some broken glass over by the ice machine. Uh, I need to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot though. Oh, don't worry about it. You got a lot on your mind, you know, sitting here doing nothing. I'm sure I'm I'm sure you're busy. Yo, Ben, did you break this motherfucking flashlight? Was it you? No. No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried. <laughs> I know you're just a with the third degree. I didn't break any flashlights. <laughs> okay then. I know you're a fucking piece of shit, so I'll forgive you if you broke our fucking flashlight, Ben. You fucking piece of fucking shit oh god just like a piece of shit like that to be named ben too all righty let's go let's go ben oh right his last name is paul too so he's named ben and he has a first name for a last name what a fucking asshole what a mook what the fuck is that doing here It's chalk. Who do we know that uses chalk? Doc. <laughs> a clue. Me. What do you think it is? It's chalk with an X on it. Anything. Maybe it's a sign. <sighs> My God, fucking duck. Could be. Could be a sign. Pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. It's pink chalk, which is gay. Uh, Clementine, you're the one stealing the drugs, Clementine. Why are you aching oxycodone? Why? Why would you do this, Clementine? Why would you do this to me? Why would you betray the group, Clementine? Tell me about the X. What does the X mean? Do you have any pink chalk? No. Oh. It's gone somewhere. Okay. So you, you lost it. <laughs> I love how she assumes you just are are looking for the chalk because you want to use it. It's so sweet. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Wow. Really? Totally. I was coming to see if the clue was yeah, done. Yeah, I got it. Good job. <laughs> you were actually useful. Don't ruin the moment. Yeah, I'm gonna high five duck. Tuck thinks you're incredibly awesome. Oh, that's good. That's good, right? That's that's a nice little detail. And look at fucking Duck. Oh my god. Yo, Duck, you didn't break this flashlight, did you? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. <laughs> that's probably a good thing. <laughs> uh, can I tell him about the murder? You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk? You found the scuff here? This is gonna sound crazy, but you're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. <laughs> okay. Have, Have we found, found anything, anything else? else? Just the chalk. Mr. Robin? I found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, I won't. <laughs> Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. Yeah, don't don't get out of this fucking gate. There's a chalk scuff right there, filled with scuffed chalk. Somebody was over here too. Hmm. See, I did good, huh? Yeah, you did. Duck, you did. Surprisingly so. There and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Yeah, no, it's pretty dangerous out there. You saw all the bullet holes and arrows. Let's go. It opens inward. That's fucking stupid. You should have it only open outward. That way people can't push it in. You know, or if you need to escape, you can't, you can't fuck, you can just push out to escape so that you don't have to, uh, you know what I mean. Jesus Christ. It's not a good way to build a fort is what I'm saying. Uh-oh. Peels. Pills here. Pills here. Pilsner. Beer. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. Dun 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 dun. Meds in it. it was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Uh. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. That's not true, Lily. What is the difference? Yeah, there's a big difference. Time gets sick and we don't have what we need. There's still a big difference there, Lily. What the hell? The thing is, is that even if you uh, try to help her dad, her dad still dies anyway, so she still go starts going crazy like this. And because, yep. Yeah. You're right. How? Okay. Alrighty. Uh, you made the biggest mistake of your life. You better give me some more of that medicine before I start shooting out of you with my big guns. 